everyone. For today's science activity, we are going to be experimenting with paper marbling. Now to do that, you are going to need to collect a few things. You are going to need a piece of card, a pair of scissors, a plate, a spoon, some shaving foam, a lolly stick, a cocktail stick, some food colouring and some kitchen roll. Now the first thing that we're going to do is take our piece of A4 card and we're going to fold it in half. And then we're going to cut it in half down your fold line. And we're going to take one of these pieces and we're going to fold it in half again. And we're going to set that to one side so it's ready to use. We're then going to take our plate and our shaving foam and we're going to spray some shaving foam onto our plate. So we want to have a good amount of shaving foam on our plate and then we're going to use our spoon to spread it all out nice and evenly so it's about a centimetre or two thick on our plate. Okay, that looks nice and even, you see? So now we're going to take our food colouring and we're going to drop some drops onto our plate of shaving foam. Now I have a dropper to help me do this, but if you don't have one, don't worry, you could use a spoon or anything you like just to put some drops of food colouring onto your plate of shaving foam. Now you can use one or two or three colours, it's up to you. So just drop them at random on your plate of shaving foam. Okay, and when you finish doing that, what you're going to do is you're going to get a cocktail stick and using that, you're going to mix up all of your dots in the shaving foam. So make a nice pattern that you're happy with. Just go and mix up all of your dots. just by cutting through the shaving foam with your stick. Okay, so if you can see, I've mixed up all my dots. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my piece of card that I folded in half earlier, and I'm going to put it face down onto my food colouring shaving foam and I'm going to press that in, give it a nice press and hold 
burda. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to lift it out. get something that looks like this which you might think looks a bit strange but what we're going to do is we're going to get on our lolly stick and we're going to use this to scrape off all of the extra shaving foam Now, if you don't have a lolly stick, you could use the back of a knife or anything really that's flat. Okay, and then if I get some extra kitchen roll, just make sure I've got rid of all of the shaving foam. And then you're left with a nice paper marbling effect on your piece of card. Now, the reason this works is because the food colouring sits on the surface of the shaving foam. It doesn't soak into the surface. So when you put your card on the surface of the shaving foam, the food colouring is easily transferred across. So you can experiment with different colours and see what you can do at home. So I hope you try this at home we would love to see what you do you could even experiment by adding water to the surface before you put your card down or even oil and see how that affects your paper marbling so why don't you share what you do with us at Surrey Libraries on Facebook and Twitter have a look at our YouTube channel and we'll see you again soon goodbye